Why did Amy and Matt Roloff, the heart of little people, big world, decide to go their separate ways? This tale is more twisted than a Hollywood script. Picture this, a couple that's weathered two decades, four kids, and a reality TV show, only to have their world come crashing down in 2015. Yeah, it shook us all. But what's the real scoop behind the breakup? Truth is, Amy and Matt's marriage was far from a walk in the park. Think about it. Is any reality TV couple's life? I've tried, folks, but finding a duo that's dodged the breakup bullet is like finding a needle in a haystack. Their story played out like an open book, with every argument and disagreement laid bare for the world to see. From bickering over family outings to clashing over farm sales, it was clear they were on rocky ground. When they announced their divorce, it wasn't just a chapter ending. It felt like the whole book closed, leaving fans and their kids in a state of disbelief. In their announcement, they highlighted their achievements and the beautiful family they built. But the burning question remained, why did they split? Enter the intrigue of Amy's memoir, A Little Me. Amy dropped bombshells left and right, suggesting Matt's infidelity with Karen Chandler, the farm manager who became his fiance. According to Amy, the evidence was as clear as day with inappropriate exchanges that crossed lines. Yet, Matt's stance? He's been adamant that Karen was never part of the picture until after his marriage to Amy was over. However, his own words from their 2007 joint memoir hinted at a less conventional view of commitment, revealing a crack in their foundations long before the public drama unfolded. Fast forward, and the plot only thickens. Amy and Matt's interactions, strained by their shared business and complicated family dynamics, add layers to an already complex story. The anticipation for the 25th season of Little People, Big World is sky high, with promises of diving deep into these turbulent waters, especially as Matt gears up to marry Karen. But here's where it gets interesting. Amy, having turned a new leaf, married Chris Merrick right there on the Roloff Farms, embracing a new chapter filled with love and hope. The upcoming season teases not just wedding bells, but also the quest for a new home for Matt and Karen, stirring the pot even further. How will Amy react to the latest developments? Surprisingly, she seems more focused on bridging gaps within the family than fueling any fires. But as we all know, reality TV thrives on the unexpected. Can this fragile peace last, or are we on the brink of another storm? And that's the dish, my friends. The ongoing saga of Amy and Matt Roloff is a testament to the complexities of love, fame, and family. What's your take on this roller coaster journey? Team Amy? Team Matt? Somewhere in between? Spill your thoughts down below because this conversation is far from over. And remember, if you loved this deep dive, show some love with a like, hit subscribe for more, and ring that bell to stay updated on all the drama. Till next time, keep shining, keep sharing, and most importantly, keep being you. Max signing off, peace.